All right, in this video, we're going to do a little a quick lesson on uh, locking layers. Uh, if you haven't seen the video about how to post some drawings with, uh, with layers, uh, go check out those videos. In this one, we're going to uh, show you how you can lock a layer. For example, we have two alternates when we were bidding out this project. Alternate number three uh, was adding fencing around a gate to and then alternate number eight added some fencing here so if we go to this left side and you'll see the layers tab make sure that you got that checked you can see how you can turn those layers off to see what the original drawing was and then you can turn them back on and there they are the, the main focus that you may have is if you're using these projects on a job site where several people are accessing these files uh, sometimes you may not want layers to be able so easy to turn on and off because what if someone turns it off and then no one turns it back on and you should be building the project a certain way. So what you want to do is be able to lock those layers unless someone wants to purposely change them. For this example, alternate number three was accepted by the owner. Alternate eight was not. So we want to make sure that this does not get turned off and that alternate eight does not get turned on. So the easy way to do that is go to alternate number eight and turn it off and then you would right click on that go down to layer properties go to the default state of off and lock it. Click OK. There you go. Do the same for the addendum three but to make sure that its default state is on and locked and there you go. And so now you can look at this and you can't you can't just click on that to turn it on or off. So I hope that helps.